Yevgeny Prigozhin first met Vladimir Putin at some point in the 1990s, when Putin was deputy mayor of St. Petersburg. The Soviet Union had just collapsed, and Prigozhin had just been released from jail. He started a catering business and opened restaurants, which Putin liked to attend. That's how Prigozhin got the name Putin's chef. And soon he began doing other tasks for the man who would become Russia's president. He set up a farm of internet trolls so that Moscow could influence elections in other countries. And he set up a shadowy group of armed men called Wagner, who worked as mercenaries in Syria and across Africa. When Putin began his full-scale invasion of Ukraine in February 2022, they got involved there too. But as Prigozhin's power grew, so did his anger at the elites in the Russian military. He accused them of messing up the invasion and even tried to unseat them in a dramatic move, sending his men and tanks marching on Moscow. Prigozhin's uprising lasted just 24 hours, but it shook Russia, and what will happen next to Putin's chef is yet to be seen. <laughs>